What is going on everybody? Today we're hanging out at the Motor Coach Store in Bradenton, Florida, and we have several different Newell coaches from different eras. So today we wanna show you some of these coaches and some of the differences. And today we're hanging out with the famous Bradley Twait. Brad, how you hey, doing, Andrew, sir? I'm good, how are you? You're good, not as busy as you. You're extremely busy. Always, yeah. A lot of coaches coming and going. You've probably sold more Trio Newell coaches in the world than anybody except for the Newell Coach Factory. You think that's a valid claim? We've definitely sold a lot of Trio Newell, so yeah. I, can, I can support that. So how many compared to others, not sure. We move a lot of Newell product here. Yeah. Yeah. More, more than anybody I know, but we've got some great units to show the folks yeah. today. What's going on here, sir? It's like Newell Nation, we say around here, tons of Newells. And we're gonna take a walk through about a decade worth of Newells from 2007 to 2023. Yeah, a lot of cool coaches to show them. So this coach right here, this is a timeless coach. I love the pinstripes. And you said this is a 2007? This is a 2007, believe it or not. I mean, look at this paint scheme on it. It just has one of those timeless paint schemes and the darker mahogany interior, which is really rare for an 07. So it's really rich and timeless. 2007, to my knowledge, was the first year of the P2000. There are actually a couple of 06s that came out, you know, kind of like 17, the P50 came out. There were some 2020 Ps that were still made in 17 as well. This was the introduction of the Porsche design, which this rear end, nice flowing rear end they did from that cut box style of the 2006 and prior. And then they did the updated wheel well moldings and the whole new front end. Definitely a timeless design. Still one of the best looking coaches on the For road. Sure. Is this coach available or it what's? Is. Yes, this is an 07. Let's put it in perspective on price. This is a 2007 Newell P2000i with 165,000 miles on, bath and a half for 355,555. Think about the 07 Country Coach Magnus we're selling and the 07 Affinity we were selling for 255.5, for 100 grand more, you can be in a Newell. I think that's a buy. Yeah, a lot of value to that. And, you know, Newell coaches, uh, country coaches are great too, but they Newell are. coaches still in business. Next level. And then they do have the 24 7 customer service that's emergency hotline, regardless of year of the coach. Regardless of who you bought it from. Newell is great that way. They don't care who you bought the coach from, how you came across it. The fact is, they built it, they're going to support it. Yeah, their customer service is second to none. Second to none. And you even have a personal Newell uh, 2023 that we're going to show everybody later, yeah. but let's keep looking through some of these sure. coaches. Now that's a buy at 355, 555. <laughs> yeah. uh, but now this is an 09. 09. Really cool color combination. I love this yes. coach. You can kind of see the continuation. That was one of the early versions of the pinstriping they did. And this was kind of the next generation where they reversed them. And instead of putting the stripes here, they actually put them here and faded them. Gives it a really cool look for a 2009 Newell. What a look. And I love just all the detail that Newell Coach does on the slide room here, how they bring that pinstripe through these slides. Speaking of these slides too, these are valid slide rooms. So you're gonna have the most living space in the industry. They're still using this same type of slides and same type of structure in the new 2023s and 24s today, but it's the most living space in a class A motor coach and any motor coach to my knowledge, so. Interiors were very similar from 07 to 09. Yeah, love this 09 Newell and you can see these huge windows as well. Newell Coach has the biggest windows in the industry with the biggest slide rooms in the industry as well. You can see how much headroom and how much height is here inside of this slide room. Now this is an 09. In the early 2000s, they started to lift the ceiling in the Correct. rear of the coach yep. and then slowly lifted the ceiling kind of coming. It was like a three quarter and then all the way in this body style, you've got the headroom all the way through. No so. doubt about it. Uh, the headroom in a Newell is second to none. We always say how you can stand in the slides. I mean, you're 6'2", <laughs> plenty of room. Yes, sir, and this is an 09, 09. but still the 2024s are gonna be the same headroom, same Correct. height. Yep. If it's not broke, don't fix it, right? Correct, so. absolutely. This is a unique coach where it's a rear bath. However, at the Motor Coach store, we can take this area, which has Sub-Zero, freezer fridge doors right here, and then some pantry space, and then a closet here. We can remove all this, open it up, and make this a half bath. So nice. we do have that ability to do that in this coach. Nice. It's, it's a walk-in closet. You would just have to get rid of that stuff and be really easy to do, I yeah, think. Yeah, we could reconfigure it, not a problem. Yeah, it's a huge room. Yeah, it, yeah. it does not feel like we're in a motorhome in nope. this coach. King-size bed, just a nice cozy stateroom here. I always like to point out that these wall panels, just so high-end, you know, these coaches are higher end than most people's homes. When you start to get in, you know, the heated floor, some of the newer ones start to have heated towel bars. This has a squared off shower in it, like the newer style coaches do, versus that 
curved metal frame shower. So Oceana, I believe, is the make. So this is nice upgrade here. Yeah, really nice coach. Huge yeah. rear bath too. So this is an 09, couple years newer. Do you know how many miles are on this coach? This has 94,000 miles, and we have it online for 499.999. A lot of equipment lot for the money. For half and this, this has got the cat the C15 ZF transmission. transmission as well. Yeah, yep. real desirable. Very. Now this is a beautiful coach. I love this color combination with the cream, gray, and red. Yep. A gray wheel yep. that match this color yep. scheme. Yep. Super Super cool. Now we don't see any windows on right. this rear slide room. And what does that make it? An old NASCAR coach. So is that kind of yeah. how they do it in the NASCAR yeah, circuit? They, they tend to take the windows out of the bedroom so they can go in there. They can sleep during the day, get rested up for their big race. The owner wanted the powder coated wheels, which we did. And we also took this stuff and blacked it out. Gives it a real mean look for a Newell. Yeah. And that's what a lot of the newer Newells yep. they're doing the blackout. That's kind of the new thing. Now this coach is torn apart, but let's look inside already. I can see these seats from a mile away. I'll read done. This looks like it's probably brand new upholstery. There's no way they did that back in, what did you say, it's 2010? We redid this for the owner that previously bought it and now we're reselling it. Brad, this is a huge <laughs> coach. Is. I think this is probably like the most open. I don't know why it feels so big. It's just a huge salon and this is a bath and a half coach too, Andrew. Wow, wow. Yeah. So you said they did new floor, a lot of new work. Uh, what all was done in this? We did all new upholstery on the front driver and passenger seat, new upholstery throughout the salon area, new bedding. We did new flooring and several other touches. It really came together nice. And yeah. I, I think we could uh, throw a football around in here. <laughs> I mean, this is so much living space for sure. Love the rich colors, like a chocolate brown upholstery with the light floors and then good sized galley here. Well, they did a split galley here if you look, Andrew. Well, that's why it feels so big in here with that <laughs> yeah. split galley. Instead of running it all together, they split it across the aisle. So you have a space you can work here and a space you can work there. Yeah, and then your refrigerator right here. This is a very livable, I mean, if you're very. on the road, there's a lot of purposes having this much. For then, sure. I mean, the booth area over here, this yes. is, I'm looking forward to seeing the back of the coach because there's gotta be a sacrifice somewhere. You're not gonna find it. It's just a really well laid out floor plan. Yeah, and I like that the back here kind of curves yes. around so you Instead can kind of sit straight. at an yep. angle, very comfortable. We got a lot more coaches to look at too, so. Here's your half bath area. This coach has gotta be like 75 feet long. <laughs> I mean, this does not feel, I mean, I know, without right? any cabinets here, look at how yeah. big, it's huge. How it, with a bath and a half, this yeah. is probably one of the best uses of space. For sure. Is it a 45 foot coach? 45 foot coach. And what they did is they did a super slide here, which we didn't see a lot of in this vintage. So instead of that being a closet, it's a nice big nightstand. Well, that's what they're using in the new ones too. I've never spent any time inside of this coach and I'm really impressed. And I love that with no window, just a finished off look with a fixed Samsung Gallo acoustic speakers. Still a really good sized rear bathroom. This is a great utilization of space. That same style shower like we saw in that 09. Actually, Andrew, this showcases what the motor coach store can do. We took the curved style, removed that, and put this in. So this is an all new shower that the motor coach store put in to make it look like an updated Newell. Really looks great. Did you redo the... the everything from the, here to that corner. So all the, the tile work, the glass, everything, the base, it's all new. Beautiful job. Got to tip Thank my you. hat to your team there. Yeah, very proud of it. Just a Another timeless Newell coach. How much dough does someone need to become the next owner? This is a 2010 Newell quad slide, bath and a half front entry with 195,000 miles on it for 499.999. It's a lot of coach for the money. Yeah. Andrew, this is the coach. This is a little bit newer. So what year is this coach, sir? So we crossed over now from the P2000i to the 2020p. The 2020p 2020 has Updated rear cap with new tail lights, updated one piece wheel well moldings, and new front headlights on the front. Yeah, and they're still using that same classy, timeless pinstripes. Yep. And then they started bringing in this kind of stainless around 13, 13 I think was when yeah, I first 12, started. 12, actually 12, yeah. my 12. Oh, that's right, you're yep. 12, yes sir. Yeah, and then those beautiful headlights. Now, I believe they did some other updates to the- The trainer. suspension, this has the adjustable suspension. It has their easy steer. And I believe it's the continuous dampening suspension. Correct. Yep. That really made a big difference. Huge Everybody difference. wanted the 14s. And they still do. That's why I say this is the coach. This is the holy grail that everybody's going for. And this vintage is a 2014 to a 2016 Newell that we have right here. And right around that era, there was another big change that we'll talk about in the 16 with the interior design. But let's take a look True. inside of this too. 
Now this is a super yeah. nice, I don't think I've seen inside of this coach yet. I love the colors of these cabinets. Really cool design. 2014, 2020p with some really great selections. Now I wanna point out, we're still seeing the circular design yep. on the ceiling and you were gonna see something different here in a second, but this is cool with the artwork, kind of an abstract art, a very modern design in this coach. Yes, and this is nice here for pantry, bar, coffee bar. This is a great extra area that they put in this floor plan. We got a TV on a televator over here with this nice recliner. And I like to point out, you know, 2014, but just effortless. You're not hearing that televator binding. It's not getting caught up on other stuff. It's a nice little workstation there here. Yep. Though, and too. look there, 2014, pick up a tablet. Yeah, so 2014, they added the tablets with the control centers. You can control your shades, lighting, and check that out. It's got a picture of a Newell coach there. I love how professional that is. and. Now that's a different coach, but I think that coach might have come through the uh, motor coach store here too. It a lot is. of a, uh, I know that coach. A lot of nice coaches coming and going here. And you are always buying and consigning coaches too. If folks have coaches they want to sell. Yeah, I need to buy and consign right now. We had a huge couple of weeks, as you know, sold over a dozen coaches, ten in one week, <laughs> a week before last. So it's been nuts. If you've got a late model Newell, we're here to buy or consign them. In addition to other high end late model fiberglass coach, King Airs, Prevos, Integras, and Tiffins. Is this a bath? And a half Newell. Yes, Andrew. Yeah, bath and a half coach. And I like to show, you know, just how much mm. headroom is inside of these Newell coaches. Such a beautiful, uh, timeless design in this coach. Bath and a half. Now, 14, this is still kind of, you know, they're just starting to update features. We're going to start to see a real modern texture here on this slide face. Yeah, that, that's a cork facing they have on there actually. And these designs and these finishes are so timeless. You know, some of these stones and stuff, it's like when you look at how much money it would be to rebuild this and the value that you're getting when you've got these, you know, I don't know if this is Italian marble with heated floors and all that, but a lot of value here. I bet you this is probably a couple thousand dollar bowl sink. All of this equipment, just such a nice coach. And then this is gonna have that update shower from Newell Coach Factory here in 2014? Correct. Yeah, it's factory. So was it about 13, you know, about what year they started to do more of the squared showers? Well, they started that in 12, I would say, right around that 12 mark. We got a lot more coaches to show the folks. We're going to start to get some newer Newells, but uh, how much dough do you need for this coach if someone's a qualified buyer? This is a 2014 Newell quad slide front entry, bath and a half with 74,000 miles. I've never sold one this cheap before in my life. I'm using your words, cheap, 799, 999. Yeah, the 14s, I've never seen them below 800,000. Yep, I've always been in the mid to upper eights. And usually when you see a really cheap coach like that, there's gonna be a really weird color combination or a weird floor plan, something. Not a but motor coach store. No, this is a nice coach, timeless design, yeah. Yeah, I just thought of something, Andrew, as we're going through these years and uh, we're going from oldest to newest, I have the holy grail of holy grails, Newell's coming from this vintage. I've got an 09 Newell coming with, I believe, 60 some thousand miles on it, bath and a half, front entry, Bunk Isle Coach, a true factory built Newell bunk coach. From that'll 09. Be, that'll be here at the end of this week, so you can do a sneak peek on that. I'm looking forward to seeing the colors and just that whole coach. Now, uh, do you know how much dough you're gonna need for that We're yet? We're gonna or? be at 499 on that coach. That coach is gonna go. The colors are insanely good on it. Awesome, looking forward to seeing that Can't one. Can't wait. Talking about a special coach. Day later, we were editing that video, but we had to come by to yeah. show everyone this coach. It's the one we were talking about. And was it cleaner or as clean as you were expecting? Beyond clean. Yeah, this is <laughs> immaculate. I'm looking forward to so this. is a Murphy bed, bunk, bath and a half coach. Let's go take a look inside real quick. Absolutely. And there, it just literally rolled in, what, like minutes ago? Minutes or? ago. This is a 2009 P2000i front entry, bath and a half with 70,000 miles on it, bunk coach with a Murphy bed with a theater option, family coach all the way. Everything is in the wrapper. Yeah. And Unbelievable. These, these floors here, these are pretty similar to the floors you put in your 23 uh, Similar, coach. different species, hand scraped. A nice addition they did in here though. Here at the motor coach store, what vintage of Newell coaches do you deal with? 07 to 2024. Okay, and then your PDI <laughs> process on a coach 
like this, what type of a PDI process does it's, this receive? It's going to go all the way, just like any other coach would get. We're going to go top to bottom, inside and out. Yeah, and I was talking to someone this morning, they were saying for a half million dollars, and you sell it all, but they were saying for half million dollars, when you can get something like this, why would you buy a new production coach? True. That's what we aim for. Yeah, there's just so much equipment here for a half million bucks. Uh, absolutely. And I didn't get to a chance to look. Do you know what engine this coach has? This is a Cat 625 with a six-speed Allison transmission. A lot of these Cats came with the ZF 12-speed. This is an Allison six-speed. So what a desirable coach. And Josh, just like a new coach would today. I believe that's the 4000 series Allison, is. Mm -hmm. which is much beefier than a lot of the motorhome transmissions Correct. out there. Yeah. This should go quick. I see a lot of coaches, and when you start looking in all these seams up here, the yeah. leather, cream, I mean, everything is in the wrapper in this coach. It looks like the day it was built. But a bunk model bath and a half. This is huge. Bunk model with your half bath right here. And one other thing I'm noticing, this was way ahead of its time yeah, with the style, right. kind of that more squared, rounded, yes, you're squared. Right. You're absolutely right. Normally they're much more swoopy and you know yeah, curved. This, and way that's ahead of its time. Kind of what they're doing in the new ones. It too, is so. exactly what they're doing. A lot good, of cool stuff. Catch. And then I've got to do the bunk test. That's how in the wrapper this coach yeah. is. I'm taking my shoes off here. So I'm six two, and the one thing I've got to point out, I've laid in a lot of different motorhome bunks this is a lot more rounded out so this is a lot wider than a typical twin bed and then you've got your little curtain if you want to get a little privacy here nice little cozy spot to take a nap here and then you have your lighting controls and air conditioning vents inside of your bunk too to make sure everybody gets good airflow coming back here <laughs> i'm a big fan of a murphy bed i had Me a murphy too. bed leisure travel van oh that's right i gotta tell you folks it is much easier to just put this up than to make your bed every morning <laughs> you have a lot of extra space back here i'm a big fan of the murphy bed but uh what's going on sir you have the murphy bed so you have a whole nother living area here that converts with the television on the bottom side there we can update that to a massive television, by the way. And, you know, all of you James Bond fans out there can appreciate <laughs> all the cool little stuff Newell Coach does. There's kind of a little hidden button down here. And then this just comes down very easily. Voila. And boom. Now, one of the other really cool things I love about this is having a couch in the bedroom. I think every bedroom should have a couch. It's just nice to have a spot to sit down, put your shoes on. Oh, what's going on over here? Putting down the movie theater. With all the slide rooms out, you have plenty of room here to uh, navigate through your coach. And that's another big plus about the Murphy bed is when all the slide rooms come in, you can have an easy walkway to the back of the coach. So a lot of big pluses in this coach. But when you lay in bed at night, you have a TV to watch as well. You know, you're pressing all of these buttons. Everything is working flawlessly. You can really tell this coach has been cared for pocket air door back there yeah check out these blinds that are coming down right here everything is super clean you're not seeing unusual wear even the leather around the blinds yeah this coach is in the wrapper now brad do you take specific coaches i know you're always buying coaches consigning coaches especially high-end dual coaches are there particular coaches that you'll turn away yes anything that's not well taken care of andrew we just don't mess with anything but less than the best of the coaches that are available out there if a coach does come through here and it's not to your condition even if i want to film it yep. you're like nope Gotta it's go. getting punted my old tiff and fate and i was a little <laughs> i even did a video on it and you're like nope it's going to auction and i mean that coach was still pretty tight in my opinion but well and sometimes we just need the room it's not necessarily just the quality of the coach that goes to auction since you bring that up sometimes you know we just need the space and we've done some videos with for your viewers that say hey here's this coach that's going to auction buy this before it goes yeah. otherwise it's gone so. yeah you're only dealing in the highest end motor coaches out there correct this coach just shows all the cool custom stuff that newell coach does now You've touched a lot of Newell coaches in your day. Are there any like really cool custom coaches that stick out in your memory at all? Absolutely. Some of that stuff you're filming in Newell that's uh, VIP stuff, the dual entry coach. I mean, Newell can do anything. Well, let's check out this huge rear bath. There's a lot going on in this coach. It's a little step up. Look we'll right in here so I can just close that up. You have a day shade, night shade, but check out this bull sink. Just so much high-end equipment high dollar stuff inside of this coach and then 
the tile work inside of the shower. I've never seen this style of tile in a very modern pool vibe inside of this coach. And a washer dryer back here. Now we're going into a mid-entry coach. And that's one thing Newell Coach does different. The mid-entry, yes. very popular model. Very. It's a 2016 Newell Quad Slide Bath and Half mid-entry with 56,000 miles for $999.99. But wait, <laughs> I just talked to the owner. Bob told me, drop the price on this. This happens to be a consignment unit, 888-888. And that is the least expensive 2016 ever sold. That is true, yes sir. I've never seen one that cheap. There was a big difference between this 14 that we saw and this 16, I believe. In 2015, Amber Kernan took over the interior design, so they totally redid the style of the ceilings, told, went away from the circuit lines and really turned out nice and this yes. is a classy design really nice do you know if this was a show coach or a spec coach uh, I believe this was a spec coach okay Yeah, so this, you know, the big thing that really just draws my attention right away, really cool style Very. on this ceiling here. And uh, Amber's been making some waves, but this was real early on in her career. Yeah. You think 2014, she? She actually, yeah, started in 14. Okay. You'll see some 14s that have still that traditional style of Newell versus some of this new stuff she started doing. And wow, does it look good. The big benefits of the mid-entry are gonna be easy access to your half bathroom, easy access to your galley. Yes. A lot of folks, especially Especially like race car drivers at the racetrack when you go outside of your coach with that slide room right there someone wants to buy a coach that phone <laughs> never stops ringing with the slide rooms right there you almost have a little bit of privacy we're on a front entry coach if people are driving by they might be able to kind of see more in the coach so there's something sure. about the mid entry for privacy that a lot of folks do like well it gives you a much larger kitchen area and then in the salon, what ends up happening is you turn this around and really use it as a recliner in this floor plan setup. And what else is real nice is Brian Pitts calls this the nest. So this is where the passenger sits and the pets can get in there around yeah, you. And a lot of floor area yeah, up here, yeah. Sure. And then there's no noise, there's no door. So if the driver needs to fuel up, the driver doesn't have to walk past the passenger. A lot of advantages to the mid-entry. I'm a big fan of mid-entry, but you went with front entry in your coach, huh? I did, yeah. I'm just old school, traditional front entry. Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah, so in this half bathroom here, I love all of the different design cues and textures. Really cool, like a, I don't know, bamboo kind of style up the wall there. And these Newell coach hinges, so many cool things about these Newell coaches. Yeah, now coming back into this rear bedroom, I love these floors. Do you know yeah. if these are factory from Newell? Oh yeah, or? yeah, you could see how it matches the accent wood on the front of the coach as well. So they decided to go with the, the full wood back here versus the inlay. Yeah, and they are not skimping this is not some no. cheap floors this, no, this is the, is the real McCoy scraped. and you have your TV on a lift here that comes up so very clean with these overhead cabinets again the ceiling treatments you mentioned just a beautifully appointed coach yeah, and a huge rear bathroom yeah. there I mean this is just I love how big these Newell bathrooms are with that high-end bowl sink like we discussed and then again you know that same style shower like we're seeing now with the squared edges yeah and this coach is a buy at 888 888 that's a record for this vintage but in 2017 they went to the p50 which is another big body style change so i think you have a p50 we can take a look at we do we've got a couple of them let's go so now in 2017 the p50, p50. major step yep. up probably the sexiest rear end in the motor coach industry i concur this is actually what you ended up purchasing for your personal Correct. coach a 2023 which i want to show everybody in a moment totally new design on the rear end the front whole coach whole coach the fender flares the engine side bay covers the way the awnings are put on the only thing that was kept the same would be the skin walls here and here and the slides other than that's a whole new coach yeah, so these skin walls aluminum structure yep. unlike anybody in the industry seamless one piece yep with the valid slide rooms steel structure and i have done videos at the newell coach factory they spray in that foam there's a lot a lot more than just the aluminum to give Absolutely. it that robust structure the floors have a seven inch floor where some of the other class a's aren't even close to that right and i'll leave a link to that video in the description below where we go over the whole build process the team in miami oklahoma is a class act but is this coach available and can we take a look inside it is this is on our website as well this is a 
a 2017 Newell P50 quad slide bath and half front entry with low miles, mid 20 miles for $1,444,444. However, just like we talked about with the 16, this owner wants us to bring all offers. They're motivated to sell, they've moved on, they bought some property, they want us to bring them offers. So I don't normally do that. Well, especially late P50 Newells, there's very few P50 Newells on the market. And if you want to get a brand new Newell, which is this same body style, they did a little update in 22 on the front end, which will show them on your 23. Right. Million dollars more. Yeah, 2.5 million new and like a 24 month wait as well, I believe. A little more than that. Yep. Yeah, yeah, so a lot of value here. We're already priced right. We've got another one that we're going to walk and show you that's at a million four hundred forty-four thousand four hundred forty-four dollars. They're both priced really right. Less than what you could buy them at Newell for. They're here today and he wants me to take offers below that. This spec too, this is again a timeless spec. Was this a show coach? No, or? this was a customer order. Yeah, this is a beautiful spec coach. Head in and check it out. This coach is an absolutely timeless spec. It Just is. another beautiful Newell coach. Something about the dark cabinets, the rich woods, very classy. This is Bradley Twait style here, I would <laughs> yeah, say. Yeah, there's some similar things. We did the similar floor to this. We did some dark accents and some lighter accents. So this is something they would spec today. Yeah, absolutely. I feel. Yeah, and these ceilings. So again, the ceiling almost like a hammered metal look. Yeah. Just really cool. And then there is a little art recess here where Patsy Lowe is an artist that does do a lot of paintings for Newell Coach, but... And they also got away from a lot of the Kirby curves once they got into the P50s, so you can see it's more squared off, rounded corner, but it gives you a lot more room inside those half baths and different rooms that come through this area. And more subtle edges, and then this half bathroom here. Just next level, like this texture on the wall, and then this texture on the slide face, the sink, the backsplash here, just such high-end textures. King-size bed, here yes. and just another example of the different configurations that Newell Coach can do. You have the TV on the televator. Correct. I really like it when they don't put any cabinets over the bed Me here too. just to give it a much open it feel. Does. And when you wake up in the morning in one of these Newell Coaches, you do not feel like you're in a motor home. It's, I mean, these are higher end finishes than most people have in their homes. Like I would bet you probably <laughs> don't have this Italian leather or whatever, wherever this is from. I mean, these are like yeah. very expensive materials and that's why they're so expensive. And if you're going to rebuild this coach, I mean, the materials alone and the equipment, it's a lot of value when you start looking at these different leathers and all the materials, especially with what the economy's done. Now, as we come back into this rear bathroom, I love these cream colored floors, the way that they complement the dark cabinets. And then this corner sink floor plan, again, a beautiful bowl sink with the multi-level countertops. And then that same style of shower, like we've seen kind of evolve, beautiful beautiful tile work with that beautiful inlay, a little seat. This is such a luxurious machine and Brad's extremely busy, so he just stepped out, but we're gonna go track him down and he's got some even newer coaches than this. So let's see what else he's got going on. All right, now that's a beautiful P50, but I bet you some of the viewers wanna buy some of these motorcycles or any of these motorcycles for sale. Uh, we've got a couple of them online, but let's talk about this P50. But, but real quick, before we talk about this P50, <laughs> Newell coaches have the leading towing capacity. So if you go out at the Sturgis Motorcycle Rally, which I think that's where the first time we met. It is, about 12 years ago, 13 years ago. Yes, sir, yeah, yeah. towing a big stack. You're a boy. Yes, sir. Yes, now sir. Now you're a man. Something like that. Yeah. <laughs> but towing a stack or trailer, the Newell coaches can effortless. 25,000 pound towing capacity. Yes. In fact, the first time we hauled a stack or trailer behind one of the newer Newells with the uh, larger towing capacity, we had a heavy load on and Heather came from be back in the coach. We were just getting on the interstate and she came up front. She says, I can't believe how well it rides with the stacker on. It's noticeably different. Now, did they go from a 20,000 to a 25,000 yes. when they went to the P50? I don't have the lineage on when they actually made that cut. It'd be nice to know what coach number that is, though. Maybe you could yes. make a call on that and drop it in the comments below. Great. We'll call I'll James change. Nethery, yeah. VP of Engineering at Newell Coach. We'll He'll find that number. out. Yeah. yeah. That'd be good to know. I'd like to know that. Yeah, James is a class act. He is. Absolutely. Up, up. James. As well as the rest of the team at Newell Coach. But yeah. 2017, my buddy Rick's coach yeah. really cared for this. Rick, hope you're doing well, man. We're, we're praying for you. Absolutely. Great, great guy. He had Ryan Lowry 
Fouts do a new paint design on this coach about a couple years ago. He was my neighbor down in Fort Myers area. Yes. Before he bought this, him and I chatted about this coach and yep. I just told him like, this is the right one. But if you could just change one of the stripes. Change one stripe on it and change the whole coach. Yep. I'm not a blue guy, I love this coach. It contrasts with the white, blue, black and gray, it's gorgeous. So Newell coach redid the paint job on it, but the interior of this coach is what it's, it's cool all coach. about. Is this coach available? It is, it's on our website, just like that last 2017 P50 we looked at. Front entry coach, quad slide, bath and half, miles in the mid 20s, $1,444,444. And you can buy it today. Today. I've never seen this coach in this lighting. When yeah. we filmed it the first time. You were outside probably. And now you can hit the nightshades and make it dark like this, but there's just something about a Newell coach at yeah. night. My partner AJ took this to Barrett Jackson. We were in this coach at night and man, is it sexy inside. Yeah, well these underlit countertops, yeah. that's an expensive option. Big time. And then these floors, I love these are the newer so style wide. floors with the large, large formats. Yep. Yeah, almost like a concrete. It's more of a mat, I think, so that the dogs aren't sliding around yeah. on it. Nice wide recliner, really, that cream leather is just flawless. And then over this lot of seats, this is like a party coach. Well, and this comes out as well, so you can extend this all the way around and then this table goes in and out, up and down. And the leathers that they use, you can tell this is the highest quality materials. Yeah. When you go in all these different motorhomes, Newell Coach is not yeah. skimping on quality, no corners cut here. Yeah, so. we order the same leather from Garrett Leather and I have think it's a second to none the way it feels so supple and just a good quality leather. Well, and the way it holds up too, when we see Tops. these Newell coaches, you yeah. know, 10, 15, 20 years old, you know, slide faces, all these textures. And again, uh, so this is another kind of a different ceiling, still some rounded lines. Yeah. Another cool design though, huh? Yeah, it's very cool. It has a gloss effect to it, but not a mirror. So it just offsets to this matte floor. It looks really good. Love the hardware they did on this refrigerator. Yeah, and these dark, Cabinets really complement the light color Timeless. comms. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Here's your half bath. Love what they did with the window surround with the solid surface material and then a textured window. Beautiful backsplash tile up the side of the wall. Again, those larger tiles like we saw in the salon. Just so nice how everything comes together. And then, and then a little wine refrigerator right here. I know some of you can appreciate that. Yeah, this is a nice coach. Beautiful stateroom. And then we're seeing a Patsy Lowe painting there. I like right. that abstract painting that ties in those exterior colors. Well, on the interior too, it draws all the colors together there. She always does phenomenal. Oh job. yeah, TV and a televator. Again, those huge new old windows. windows. And I really like that they brought the huge floor tiles back in. That's the same style you're gonna see on some of the brand new coaches as well. And then the multi-tier countertops with that underlit glass bowl sink. Just so rich and so tiny timeless inside of this coach. Now this coach is extremely special behind us. Yes, uh, it is. 2022 when Ryan Laux took over the paint design. Yeah, this is coach 1725. He started on 1724. Which, which you just George's sold. George's coach that I just sold. Yes, sir. So we've sold three 22 newels in the last 30 days. We've sold a 22 feather light in the last 30 days. We've sold a 19 newel in the last 30 days. So that one six five five to two million mark, we've got heavy, heavy traction on. So again, I want to shout out that we need some inventory. So anybody that's got a coach in those demographics, we'd love to buy it or put it on consignment. Yeah, so this is Newell Coach 1725, the biggest slide rooms, the most yeah. living space in a Newell. I would call 1724, the coach before this, the piece de resistance, if you would, from Newell, because it was, everything came together on that coach. Yes, it did. It was the first Ryan Lauchs design. It was all of Amber selections. It was an incredible floor plan with the two full bathrooms in it. No bunks with no two bunks. full bathrooms. Yeah, I so. like that, two showers. I think the yeah. coach builders need to start doing more yeah. floor plans for couples. So you want a little take, bigger one in the mid-size. Well, size, but so. you and your wife want to take a shower at the same time before you go out to yeah. dinner after partying or hanging out all day. So yeah. uh, I really like that That's coach. Cool, cool deal. So, and this was the second one and wow, what a coach. A lot of the Ryan Lobs design have more detail work in them, but this just had the subtle smoke subtle. in it. Yep. Really they cool wanted. design. There's another special coach with the Ryan Lox paint job. You think we can take a look at that real uh, quick? We're both a little partial. Come on. Now this is a special coach. Newell coach 1755. I actually went up, visited you in Michigan, Michigan. and we filmed this coach yeah. up there. So drop that video down below. Yeah, we'll do that for sure now. great video. Yeah, I really enjoyed yeah, hanging enjoyed out with you time. and Heather up there. Yeah. And this is your personal coach.
coach. Now this coach is not for sale. You buy and sell these coaches, but when it came time to choose a personal coach, this was it? Yeah, you just get to one of those points in life where you want to do something special and uh, Heather and I did it here and we're just couldn't be happier with it. You and I and Ryan Lauk sat down at the Newell Rally. Yeah, and yeah we before. Talked, talked about your paint design and the camera doesn't do justice, but there's so much metallic and drop shadows, all kinds of cool stuff going on. What was your inspiration for the paint design in this coach? <laughs> it was a 22 feather light as it turns out. So that you just sold last that I week. I just ended yeah. up buying and selling last week. Yeah, so that was the inspiration. We went crazy on it though with the drop shadows and the things. This just jumps off the coach. In 2022, they did a little facelift update. Let's look on the at, front, at yeah. the front of this here. Hey, Andrew, before we go, I want to point out the best hitch that I've ever owned. This isn't a paid advertisement. This is just uh, letting everybody know that the Gen Y hitch, if you go to genyhitch.com, I believe you'll find their products. This is a torsion hitch for my stacker, and it makes all the difference in the world from dolphining. Because what happens is this hitch right here moves on these torsions and takes out all the dolphin effect with uh, pulling a stacker coach and it all rides right there. Yeah, now do you sell those here at the motor coach store? Uh, we can, or you can get them direct from Gen Y. But you're not trying to, you're just no. shouting them out, you're not trying to sell them or? Nope, just get them, everybody a great tip for hauling a stacker trailer. Now, aren't those pretty expensive hitches? They are, a thousand bucks, give or take. Okay, did you get what you pay for? Now, so we saw the rear end was pretty similar to the P50, the 2017 P50, and actually, you and I had a disagreement <laughs> about this. I've been busting your chops about this because in 2022, when Ryan Laubs came on board, they started bringing in the they paint did. designs and you didn't want more paint yeah. design on the front of the coach? I don't follow the trends. I have my own path that I forge and this was one of them. You know, all my cars are black, so I just love the black front end on this and we ended with the black in the rear end, so it, just, now, it works for me. Now, I did beat you up because I said this is gonna look like a 21 or a 2020 because that 17 has a very very similar look in front end to this. Similar, but different. But you know, hey, you, you're the paying customer, <laughs> so you get to make those decisions. Well, they have a nice grill that they did here and got rid of that glass piece that was up yep. here. So it's just, it is a different look all the way around. Yeah, and when this lights up at yeah. night, it's just so good. Nothing like Correct. a Newell coach at nighttime. But Correct. Brad, you've got so much going on. I know you've been getting pulled in a lot of different directions. Yeah. Really appreciate you taking appreciate the time to share some great information with us. I'm gonna call the folks at Newell to get a couple answers on those questions right. but anything else that you'd like to share with the folks on YouTube call me so I can buy your coach or consign it <laughs> that's what we need right now yeah the sounds... market is hot yes sir well Brad greatly appreciate you sir appreciate you Andrew also greatly appreciate all of you out there on YouTube subscribing to the channel and also make sure to check out the motor coach stores Instagram and Facebook they're trying Thank to you. get the coaches out as quickly as they we come are. in to keep you guys in the loop sometimes when I'm traveling I can't get this stuff as quickly as we'd like to so make sure to follow them on Instagram Definitely. and Facebook so Hope you're all having a great day. Thanks again. Thanks and see you soon. Mm -hmm.